you mentioned sparring. Yeah. You've had some pretty well-known uh, sparring partners. Yeah. During, during your, your, your career. Uh, yeah. two, two of the guys are two of the biggest uh, names in boxing. Uh, mm. Javante uh, 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 Tank. Davis Dick, Tank. Yeah. And, uh, and uh, Shakur. Yeah. Shakur, and uh, Shakur Stevenson. Yeah. So um, talk talk to us about being being in the ring sparring with those guys because those are you know some of the guys that you might have to see on your journey up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, nah, those it was it's very interesting sparring those guys. Uh, and it's like two obviously because their styles it's two type of different mindsets you have to go in when it comes to sparring. And, you know, with Tank, uh, he's fast, he's explosive. You know, what I'm saying like sometimes he likes to lure you in and use his reflexes to make you throw a shot and then, you know, he'll like explode with a nice uppercut to the body or a nice uppercut up here, up to the top. So it's certain things that, you know, I have the reflexes to keep up, you know what I'm saying? So uh, it's like really interesting to uh, go back and forth when it comes to, you know, our reflexes and everything like that. But yeah, now Tank is strong. That's one thing I, they don't call him Tank for no reason, man. That dude, that dude can punch, you know what I'm saying? So I'll be on my P's and Q's when it comes to him. Uh, and Chakor, you really got to be in your P's and Q's with that guy because it's not like, you, you, you're you not as cautious when it comes to the power with Shakur, but his power is still respectable, but it's like he will beat you down and frustrate the heck out of you if you let him. Like, in order to touch him, just to touch him, you got to think outside the box because he's a master of his defense. He's a master of distance. He's a master of, you know, of his craft when it comes to that, you know what I'm saying? He's like, he's a really hard worker, but you could tell his competitiveness is like, you know, is like different. Like that dude is an animal, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, so it's always like a chess match when I'm in the ring with him. Do you think it's, it's, it would be harder for you in a, in, in an actual fight against uh, Shakur Stevenson or against Tank Davis? Well, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I was about to say trip. Don't, don't, don't set the man up because, that yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, in the future, to, yeah, he yeah, to that, me up, you know what I mean? that that might be. <laughs> I'm working on the fight right now for you. I'm trying to set it I, up. I'm just saying <laughs> that there, there is potential that they may have to see each other at some point. So you don't want to give away too much right now about yeah, who yeah, might no, be no, a more no, difficult that's opponent. That's but you know what I mean? I would say that you know, it will. One thing I will say is that it will be an interesting fight if I was to fight either one of them guys. That's all I would say. Okay, you know I mean, that would be an interesting fight. Something that. You know, uh, the viewers are gonna want to tune into. Do you do you go into to these sparring sessions with like a little like you know what I really want to kind of show do my thing in here just to show the, <laughs> whatever. Do you ever go into a sparring match like that? I mean, not really to be honest. Like I don't really be trying to show off and all like that. But really, I, when I'm sparring, I'm trying to get that. I'm trying to get some work. I work on different things. Sparring is like. You got to look at sparring like basketball practice. It's practice. You know what I'm saying? You make all your mistakes and you try all your new tricks in sparring. You know what I'm saying? So it's already perfected by the time you fight. So I don't really go in there trying to show off and nothing like that. Like, I really want to get some good work with good people. And, you know, it's always good to have a good dance partner. And that's how I like to look at it. And those are the two of the best if, you, if you're going to get one. Definitely. Those two definitely. Guys. You talk about the right side. Big shout out to real fans, real talk throws. Yeah, they ain't. <laughs> it got different when I'm on.